Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel, Sci Explore, and let's begin to explore the world of science. If you will be able to gain some knowledge from this video, please subscribe my channel and click on the bell icon below to keep in touch with new videos. Have you ever wondered how animals behave according to human orders? For example. How does your puppy learn to do what you say? This phenomena is known as imprinting. Imprinting is a process by which some species of animals form an attachment to the first large moving object that they meet upon hatching. So guys, here in this video, I am going to explore the scientific background behind the imprinting behavior. Many scientists have developed various concepts to explain the imprinting behavior, but it was first well described by a famous zoologist known as Conrad Lawrence in 1930s. In his experiment, he took a large clutch of goose eggs and kept them until they were about to hatch out. Then he placed half of the eggs under the protection of a goose mother while keeping the rest in an incubator with making sure he was the first moving object the newly hatched gooselings encountered. When the geese hatched, Lawrence imitated a mother duck's quacking sound upon which the young birds regarded him as their mother and followed him accordingly. And the other hatched eggs that kept under the protection of mother goose followed the mother goose. This was the first observation that helps Lawrence to find that geese follow the first moving object they see and this phenomena is known as imprinting and suggests that attachment is innate and programmed genetically. Now scientists have revealed that imprinting behavior can be applied in many cases in order to overcome certain problems. A famous example is the saving of California condos with the Kaisel and hand puppets. California condo is the largest flying bird in North America with wings that spread 9.5 feet tip to tip as it soars at speeds up to 50 miles per hour, 1000 feet above the earth. California condors are considered as critically endangered. Therefore, wild animals are moved to Los Angeles Zoo and San Diego Wild Animal Park for captive breeding programs. California condors lay only one egg every other year in the wild and therefore to speed up egg production caretakers removed eggs from the nests to hatch in an incubator. After hatching it needs to be feed the chicks without involving of the mother or father condo. But in this case human interaction with condo chicks is always kept to a minimum in order to prevent chicks from becoming acclimated to people, which will help keep them safe once released into the wild. Therefore, in order to overcome this, caretakers use a special tool known as hand puppet to feed in the chick that is designed to look like adult condos. Puppet is kind of like a fancy globe 
it covers hands of caretakers so the chicks don't get any beneficial experience from the people in 1982 the chances of seeing a california condor in the wild was particularly nil but today more than 300 california condors live in the wild and nearly 200 are in captive breeding programs so guys i am going to end the video for today i hope you have gained some knowledge on imprinting if this video make any sense please like subscribe and share this video